Hi, I have today this project with some text, with a table and some text also, but you can see the text in the table looks very awful because uh, the table doesn't fit in a portrait page. So I need a landscape page, but I don't want to enter uh, before this table and to move in a, a landscape page. I want everything to be automatically. And after that, the next text to go in a portrait page. How we can do that in two moves. So let's go to table properties. We tell the tables to begin with a new page, a different page. So we activate page break, okay, page break before that table with landscape page. So we have that table in the next page, landscape. So it's much better. Now we select the next paragraph, go to paragraph, again paragraph, and from here we go to text flow, insert page before this paragraph. So we want a new page. We don't want to stay with the text on the same page with this table with default style, with portrait style. So let's see what we have. A portrait page with some text, a landscape page with that table we wanted, and the text move it on the next page. So we have page break. Before this table, you can see the page break here with a page style landscape. The page is landscape. Let's see, let's uh, press OK and see that. So the page is OK. On the next page, it's portrait. So let's go to paragraph, paragraph. And we have insert page before that, uh, that paragraph with default style that is portrait. Very easy, very easy to do that in two moves. Properties for tables and properties for the first paragraph we choose. Thanks for watching and please subscribe every week uh, for a new video. Thank you.